Hi, I'm Jay Loritz. I'm a resident of this area and the neighborhood curator. And uh, these are some murals that we've had done to help revitalize the neighborhood. This whole area used to just be basically strewn with garbage and covered with really messy, random graffiti tags. And uh, we started having the artists do the murals as a way to sort of cut down on the graffiti and make people realize this wasn't just a forgotten area and that, uh, you know, not to just come throw the garbage here. And as you can see, it's made a huge difference. There's almost no graffiti on the building whatsoever. And the garbage is gone. And uh, it really helped improve the character of the neighborhood a lot and created a sense of community where people kind of come, to, come together around this as sort of the center of the neighborhood. This is a new piece uh, that was just done a few weeks ago. This is an older piece from uh, some guys, uh, one guy from South America, I think from Argentina, and a guy from South Africa. They came together and met here to do this as a collaboration. A lot of our artists come from uh, different places internationally. I'm Dariel Martinez, and this is um, part of the New York Street Gallery project. Here is Nepo from Puerto Rico, then it's Rimax, and then it's Show Discipline. And uh, this is a project um, about street art. We do murals around to help the community and also to let the artists express themselves in a different way. We found people that give us the permission to do this kind of stuff. And uh, we just want to promote ourselves and promote the artists and let the people enjoy this public art that don't cost anything. That's why we got the name of New York Street Gallery because you don't have to buy the art to see it, you know, or to enjoy it. And it's part of you and part of your community. Anyone could do it, you know, it's different forms, you know, it's a different between graffiti and street art, but it's all urban art because it's outside, you know, it's, it's a street art because it's kind of fine art in a different form, you know, people use cans, different forms of expression, but at the end it's all art, you know, it's just a different way to they express what they do. And it's part of a culture, you know, the street art comes from the graffiti, the graffiti is part of the hip-hop culture, so it's just like a big family, you know. 